I've got an exceptional tour for y'all right here, ladies and gentlemen. Now, this is a home right here. Let me just say that I, I'm going to say it's on the smaller end, but just hear me out. On the smaller end for some of the homes that I tour that are really, really big, this is still a great size house. Uh, but what I'm trying to say is it's a little bit on the smaller end, but we still have like a living room and a den and just a lot of unique stuff on this particular model that I don't think you've ever seen. So stay tuned. It's going to be a good time. It's going to be a wild ride. Fasten your seat belts. Let's look at the shake vinyl that we have right here. Plus we have some rock around our front door. Now I am at Town and Country Homes. Uh, this is in Tupelo, Mississippi. Now this is just kind of on the end of their lot down here. They have a dealership full of inventory, full of homes, double wides, single wides, all kind of types of homes, whether you want some really high end stuff, whether you're wanting some more, you know, lower end affordable stuff. They've got all types of homes. I encourage you to check them out if you're over this direction, okay? Let's see where our back door is positioned, which is right here. Plus we have some sliding doors right here. And they've been doing a little bit of staging on this house. Hey, watch out now. They've been doing a little bit of staging, so that's why those sliding doors are open. But notice we have our uh, lights here. We've got us a water faucet here. We've got us an outside outlet right there. And let me step back. Now we've got windows there, windows there, and that's in that's in that. Or don't you be looking. Don't you be looking, okay? We're going to, I'm going to finish it. That's in that uh, den area that I was talking about. And obviously, the vinyl and stuff will be put on. Uh, this is just a show model. Let's head back around. And we're going to, um, we're going to make our way inside. Now, if you haven't already, drop me a like on the video. That'll help us out so much if you'll take time to do that. Now, now, buddy, you, you get those, your brakes. He's about to break something. <laughs> See what I do there? <laughs> All right, yeah, okay. We got the stone here around our front door. Now our steps are around the back, so I'm actually have to go in there, but I do want to make an entrance from the front. So what I'm gonna do is roll a little intro, show you a few things, and then we're gonna be on the other side of that door. Let's go. tell you what did i tell you it's where i was gonna be i'll open this up maybe bring in a little bit of light right here mm, i love I, I love the winston homes y'all know i do a lot of their homes but the floor plan on this one i think y'all are gonna really enjoy just because it's a little bit on the smaller side but you still got a den and everything we got our tray ceiling in here We've got, hold up, don't pass that up, the good book. We've got our entertainment area here. You've got your hookup for your TV, satellite. We've got uh, got us a nice light right here that would be on under this. Uh, very, uh, you also can get this in a very light, like a natural, like a really bright uh, wood color. Um, I've seen that in several of their homes. Y'all know what I'm talking about if y'all watch a lot of the tours. We got the stone around the fireplace, the electric fireplace. Yes. I like how they went with this different trim right here around your marriage line. Just uh, kind of caught my attention as we ease, ease over into the kitchen. We've got some more of the stone, some more of the stone that you're gonna see right here. Now this is gonna be some of those new countertops that I've talked about in several of the tours. Yep, I've seen these same countertops in another home, actually the one right beside us in an area of that house. It's very nice as well. It's one of my favorite models, honestly, that I've ever toured. It may be, I was saying in the tour, it may be a home that makes the top, one of the top homes of the year.
Look at all the area that we have just right here. I mean, you got room to do a little salsa, you know, if y'all like to cook. And I ain't, I ain't talking about the salsa you eat. <laughs> Boy, I'm a... <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna stop laughing at myself because I feel like I'm the only one laughing right now. The rest of y'all, I officially, y'all officially muted me. Hey, get. we've got our back door right here. I showed y'all that on the exterior. Water heater is gonna be behind that panel. This is where your furnace is gonna be. Obviously, your eight cold stuff's not in this particular model, but. Um, most time, pretty much all the time, these homes are going to come with central heat and air hooked up and everything once you get them set up. So yeah, washer and dryer, plus we have cabinets in here and we got access to our attic and your breaker box is over here, kind of out of the way. But if you need to be able to get to it, mm -hmm, there she is. Yeah, I quit all that sauce in there. Next up, let's go over here and check out the dining area, or the nook. Look, I seen a comment the other day, somebody's like, he obviously don't know what a breakfast nook is. Look, I know exactly. Let me, I, let me talk to you for a minute. Let me, I'm just kidding, not gonna do that here. This is your dining area or your nook, whichever you'd like to call it. These are the sliding doors, and I always talk about this set up with a back deck or a porch and i like that this door's open because i can actually come out here and pretend that we have that deck and we're like hey did you check okay you checked them okay what's that bring the tonys okay tonys Last thing I'll say, and then we'll go head down and check out the rest of the house. What about this? This is kind of like your prep area. We have an electrical outlet there. Okay, let's head down this direction. We do have our den, but we're gonna start with the bedroom. And this room is, I should be able to have y'all some dimensions, but what a room. Very, very big. You notice even in your bedrooms, you're gonna have all your crown molding, all your trim, all this nice trim around all of your doors, your door casings and everything like that. And then we come out, we come into our bath, our guest bath. And I like the way this one's set up. Don't forget to drop a comment. Let me know what you think about this particular home. And I also would like to encourage, encourage you to check out our playlist. We have playlists for all the different types of homes that we tour. So if there's one in particular that you really enjoy, then we have a playlist for that. Once again, if the salsa continues, into, <laughs> you got room in here. You got plenty of room. Now, this is the den. This is where all those windows, remember I was telling you? And it kind of really shows you because the sun's over that direction starting to ease down for the day. And you can tell a lot of light that comes in here. Now, obviously when you have a den or a media room like this, you could do a lot of different things. I've seen a, over the years of touring these amazing homes, I've seen some crazy stuff done in these rooms, just to be honest with you. <laughs> tell you what, one time I was, not gonna get into that, but I tell you, one of my favorite things that I would like to have in a room like this, if, if, if it was my home personally, well, let's be honest, it'd probably be a kid's playroom because Cullen would take over. But I would love to have a really cool like hangout room for the fellas, like a man cave or something. That's just kind of my thing. But you know, it probably wouldn't happen like I said, because I don't wear the pants in my face. <laughs> uh. Once again, we got a great size room, nice size closet, a lot of trim and supplies, and once this house gets reset up, all this will have to be reused. Yeah, I mean, I don't know if you would have a man cave in here with this bedroom right here, because, you know, then your kids would still be interfering. You may just have to have your man cave in, a, in another 
another piece of on another piece of the property. But this would be a nice movie room, just a good hangout room for the family. Those are beautiful. Never seen those bar stools. We'll ease into the main bedroom and it's a, it's a big room as well. This is a three bedroom house, uh, you know, plus your den. And it's, to me, I don't believe it's that, this may be what, like a 56, 60 footer. I'm not really looking at it right at the moment, but you could tell it's just not an extremely long house, but you still got a lot of square footage in all your bedrooms. I'm seeing this house be a, a really nice particular option if you're looking for something, you know, in that 15 to 1800 square foot range. Obviously you want it really nice. You'd like to have it den. Um, I could see this being a real contender. Once again, I'm not even gonna say it. Lots of cabinets in this bath, as you can tell. Here is that tile shower. So this is that same tile, which I was talking about in a previous tour that I'd done here today. This was what was in that Sipsy, that single wide that I absolutely loved. And y'all really seemed to enjoy it because it got a lot of action on the channel. But, you know, when it comes to customization, these homes, a lot of different options that are available for you. Stick around. We'll get into a lot more of that, all the details and everything on this model and just more about uh, the industry and everything in general. Uh, but let me say, do not forget to subscribe to the notification bell. That will help us out. One thing that'll really help us out a lot is sharing this video. And also, last thing, another thing that'll help us is hitting that like button. I mean, if you messed around and did all three of those, look at this. Mason jar soap dispenser. That's pretty nice. If you was to do all three of those, let me tell you, you would be... Now it's the part of the tour where you get to look at me. <laughs> you know what? Y'all be honest with me. I've been doing these outros for years now, and I just feel like, am I looking fat? <laughs> but yeah, let's talk about some details, pricing, and all that good stuff, and stick around because I got something good to share you about the trip and stuff that I'm on at the time that this video is actually out. Now, let me say when it comes to this house, um, you could also get this home in a four bedroom option. That's why I didn't want to put the floor plan up at the beginning. I'm going to put it up right now because the only floor plan I'm able to find is this four bedroom option. Uh, but you can see there, they did the den. And obviously it just depends on what you need. But me personally, I really like the den option. Um, unless you need a four bedroom, you know, unless you got several kids and you, and you need that fourth bedroom. For me to be a home that's a little bit on the smaller side and still offer that den, I think that's the option that I would go for. Uh, let me say I'll have some information in the description. We'll have some links in the description. We have our website link that's in the description where you want to get in contact with someone. You want to see about getting financing, pre-approvals, and all that. Use that in the description. Also, we have our members area where I just take a deep dive on each home that I tour each week and exclusive content like what I'm about to tell you as far as the trip. I actually told everybody in that uh, group uh, when it came out Saturday night and, or Sunday morning. And so, yeah, if you, you know, you just want access to exclusive stuff, family stuff, just all kind of different stuff, check that out. The links will be in the description below. But yeah, what is it? Right now it's Thursday uh, when this video comes out Thursday night. And so I'm at 
the Louisville, Kentucky show. Now, I don't know if y'all remember, but that was one of the first shows that really kicked the channel off, man. And so I was super excited. It's been canceled every year. This is the first year they've had it since 2020. And um, at this point, I'm recording. This is on a Saturday because I'm trying to get ahead, but I'm, I'm expecting really big things. Y'all stay tuned. I'm hoping maybe I can drop the first one Saturday night. We'll just see. I don't really know at this point. Uh, but it's not a it's not a public show. It's for dealers and retailers. But I'm able to tour some of the homes for y'all. Uh, so you get really an exclusive look at a lot of the new models. And so it's pretty amazing. I mean, I've, I've got all week planned out there. So I'm hoping I get some crazy stuff to be able to share with you in the next few weeks. So with that being said, y'all stay tuned. The videos come out Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday night, 645 Central Time. Now on to pricing. And when it comes to pricing on this particular model, obviously got to keep in mind if you go with that fourth bedroom or whatever you plan to do there, a lot of options on this house. Uh, I've seen another version of this home in the past and you had different, you know, uh, you had some different countertops. You didn't have the stone. You had more of, uh, you know, like a, uh, what is the ship lap and stuff like that. So all those have factors as far as pricing. Keep in mind what you need in your area, your county regulations, you know, all the stuff that you need with your setup and everything. This would just be a good range, just to give you a good idea what you get this home for. And this would be for at the time of recording. I'll keep all those things in mind right up above us. It's a great idea on a uh, range on this particular model. But see, when I'm recording, I can actually see myself right here. And it's like, when I talk, I get a, another chin. I just don't know where that's... <laughs> It could be all the terrible food I've been eating. Hmm. Tell you what, though, I've been doing a lot of fast. Okay, I'm not getting into all that. Hey, hope you have a wonderful day. Saturday night at this point, I don't know what it's going to be. It could be a brand new home. If not, I do have some other homes that I've previously toured. So y'all stay tuned. 645 Central. Hope to see you right back here. God bless you all. See you.